Bringing old school sound to the new shit. What is going on, everybody? YouTube, what's up? What's up? So I got these new mirrors from Amazon. I'm going to put them on the Riker. They're universal mirrors with a 7 8 size for the Riker handlebars. And that's what these things look like. And that's what these things are going to be looking like when installed. So I'm going to put them on the Riker and see how they work. Let me take them out so you can take a look at them. The hardware is pretty simple. So this is the hardware that's going to go on the handlebars. Ooh, I almost dropped it. My bad. And um, this is where the mirrors are going to screw into. So I, I believe they're going to go either this way or that way. I haven't decided how I'm going to install those yet. And then I hate doing these unboxing with one hand because I don't want to drop anything. Get out of the package here. All right. So this is the mirror here, as you can see. And this is the base of it. So that's going to screw into the uh, the hardware. And then the mirror is going to either sit that way. Or I haven't decided how I'm going to put these on. Um, plastic doesn't seem like a good quality product so far. But uh, a lot of uh, Riker uh, guys have used this one before. So... We'll see how that works and how long they last. Like I said, this is all plastic. Uh, plastic here. Uh, this is all uh, metal or aluminum, if you will. And um, so is the hardware. It's aluminum. So we're going to put these on. It's real simple to put it on. Basically, like I said, just imagine that my finger was the handlebars. And then it's going to screw in. And then the mirror is going to screw into this part. Uh, the bottom of the mirror which is this is going to screw into uh, this part here and that's how it's gonna um, go on these are pretty cheap i think um i can't remember what i paid for them i think it was less than 25. so they're definitely not expensive if these don't work out then i'll just end up getting the ones from sling mods um you know that seem to be better quality i think the ones from sling mods are probably uh, uh maybe hard and aluminum or steel whatever but we'll put these on you know um don't like the mirrors on the on the um on the Riker I think they're pretty cheap you know I don't like the way they look so we're gonna put these on if they don't work out just send them back to Amazon so I'm not gonna do the install part of the video because it's just really simple there's not much to it but I will uh, put these on and then show how they look. I'm not going to remove the stock mirrors. I'm going to keep them on just in case I don't like these. Um, I don't want to have to remove them and then put them back on. So I'm just going to put these on, keeping the, the stock mirrors. And if I like them, then I'll remove the stock mirrors. So there you go, boys and girls. I'm going to continue this video after I get these things slapped on, installed. And we'll see. Like I said, these are uh, mirrors that a lot of uh, Riker owners have used. There is the brand Mike Tuning Universal Mirrors. And these are the 7 8 size. And it has instructions here. Uh, different ways that you can install these. But it's really simple. I mean, I don't see why you could not get these installed. I'll even link, um, leave a link of uh, the parts on the description from Amazon so if you guys want to get these you guys can uh, find them but first things first let's get these things installed I will continue the video once these are on the Riker all right guys all right all right guys I got these installed already as you can see I'm actually filming this from my mobile phone this is all I have for now there is my cell phone holder all right, so let's get into it. Let me take the key off so that check engine light will come off. But here I am. I got them installed. Pretty easy install. Once again, 
these are the screws that you're gonna screw into the handlebars and then these will the mirrors will actually uh, screw in this base is gonna go in there like a lift this rubber grommet or whatever there you go so it has a screw here you could tighten this once you have them adjusted to where you want my main concern being that these are so cheap whether or not this is gonna get loose so I got these from Amazon they were $20 and if these didn't work out then I would have ended up using uh, or ordering rather the sling mods uh, setup as you can see I did take off my mirrors these are perfect um, I would compare these to if you've ever been on a uh, a crotch rocket a sport bike these are the type of mirrors you would probably get on a crotch rocket what I do like about these is as you can see here uh, the difference in the um, in the concrete the asphalt and the concrete so this this side with here would be your lane to the outside and this would be the lane the car is following you so you get a wider view of the cars around you unfortunately these things still vibrate no gotta put the can these things still vibrate um, just as much as the stock ones so we're still trying to eliminate that uh, vibrating from the uh, mirrors there's the key and then you turn them on you can see how much they vibrate Amazon once again I paid $20 I, I look back at my account I didn't pay 25 like I said earlier in the video I paid 19 um, you know plus the, uh, the free shipping if you order for you know anything over 25 which I did so I got the free shipping but so far I really like these I've seen a couple guys have them up I don't like them that way because I need to see what's around me and I can make a lane change because I've got this point of view so if these were just up to here I would probably get that um, one thing I will say is when you look in the rear in these mirrors the car behind you looks like it's right up on you and it's not so just like a normal mirror a mirror um, objects in mirror are closer than they appear but so far I do like these like these a lot I'm very happy with this purchase so there it is guys hopefully if you guys are interested in getting these um, so far for $20 I can't complain but you know the longevity of these things is gonna be the uh, the question here but from you know this is all metal this is all you want to over tighten these here too you want to you know tight but not over tighten it that's the key and there you go since I'm on this part of the bike, these are the Domino um, race grips from Amazon. They come in different colors. Um, I believe Thrill Mouse Moto was one of the first ones to have these, or the first ones that I've seen on Riker, and that's why I ended up getting these. Excuse the plane flying over, but there it is, guys. And there's my cell phone mount little crappy one it's already falling apart it's already breaking but um these leave you plenty of room to actually put other accessories on the handlebars and that's basically it but there you go there there you there you can see here and you can see the, how wide these things actually can look so that's the building behind me and you can see how clearly you can see the uh, building so if you've got a car on your left hand side or right hand side you will see it in your blind spot which helps a lot I do recommend these these are I'm just hoping they do last for $20 I mean you get what you pay for it but in so far I do like these all right guys well thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe it does help the channel and all you guys rubber down you already know three-wheel invasion keep the wheels down ride safe thanks for watching